All right, guys, so I wanted to get on here quickly to share some quick updates with you guys. Starting today, you may see a pop-up on the center of your screen that looks a little something like this. This will be Apple's first background security improvements test released to register developers and public beta testers for those running iOS 26.3. Today, I want to talk about how you can install this test on your device as of today. I also want to talk about when we can expect the next beta for iOS 26.3 and the possibility of a minor software update to iOS 26.3. 6.2.1 that could all release as early as this week. So let's go ahead and dive right in. Now, the first thing to note is that this new background security improvements is a test release by Apple to register developers and public beta testers running iOS 26.3 betas. Now you can go into settings on your device. You can head on over into the privacy and security sections of your iPhone, scroll all the way to the bottom and you find the background security improvements. Again, if you're running the beta, you'll be able to either automatically install this or you can manually install this if you don't have the automatic installation button enabled. So if you don't have it automatic, you can go ahead and install it manually. Once you go into settings, background security improvements, it'll look something like this. All you have to do is click install. In just a couple of seconds, you'll see the notification on the center of your screen, just like this. It will restart your iPhone and the test has been successfully installed onto your device. You'll see a notification like this once your iPhone has successfully rebooted. Now, I've also noticed that if you're running betas for other software updates, for example, iOS 26.2 beta or RC, you may see this pop up on your center of your screen as well. However, you would have to update your device. So let's go into settings here. Let's go into the security right here. Let's go into privacy and security. This iPhone is running iOS 26.2 RC, not the official release. If I go into background security improvements, you see here that momentarily, I'll see the pop-up appear on my screen to install the actual security patch or the test for the security patch, but it won't install until I update my iPhone. So in just a couple of seconds, it should populate on the center of the screen here. Let's give it a few seconds to see if it pops up here. And let me show you what I mean. So if you're running a beta, whether it's iOS 26.1, 26.2, or whatever iOS 26.3, it will require you to update to iOS 26.3 in order to install this you know, test patch here, as you can see right there. Now keep in mind, the background security improvements is a feature that allows you to update the security of your iPhone in order to take advantage of the latest security patches without having to update your iPhone to the latest version of iOS. Again, if you're testing any beta prior to iOS 26.3 betas, you can update your device to the latest and you'll be able to try this new patch or this new test. Now, keep in mind that iOS 26.3 Still sitting in beta one, we get the first ever background security improvements or update today as a test. And of course, we're expecting the next beta. Now, with that being said, honestly, I would think that Apple would release the next beta sometime this week. To be honest, I thought Apple would release it today, but we did get that background security improvements test, as you can see right there. So expect the next beta at any moment. Now, obviously, I'll update you guys once the next beta becomes available for iOS 26.3. But yeah, the first background security improvements test has been officially launched by Apple as of today. Now I want to talk about the possibility of another smaller software update that could be released iOS 26.2.1 before the next major release which is obviously 26.3. Now there's been several issues being reported within iOS 26.2 such as Wi-Fi connection issues, excessive battery drain, and even Face ID issues on iOS 26.2. Now although we do not have any confirmed information that Apple is working on any of these fixes, last year Apple did release iOS 18.2 2.1 right after the holiday break to address some of the bugs within iOS 18.2. So that prompts us to think that Apple will release iOS 26.2.1 in the near future to address some of these battery concerns or battery drain issues. Of course, some of the Wi-Fi connection issues that many have reported. And most importantly, the face ID issue that continues to be reported within iOS 26.2. Again, no confirmed information that Apple is working on the software update, but given the fact that Apple has previously released bug fixes before their point three update with a minor update like the point 2.1 this means that apple could release this software to the general public with no beta testing in this upcoming week as 
well. So we're expecting Apple to release the next beta for iOS 26.3, beta 2, sometime this week. And of course, hopefully, iOS 26.2.1 as an official release for all iPhone users before we see the official final release of iOS 26.3, which is going to be their next major update towards the end of January, beginning of February. So there's quite some time for Apple to still, you know, get things up and running. I'm thinking this software update could be available sometime this week. I'll keep you guys posted. Obviously, once the next beta becomes available or any software update becomes available, I'll make sure to update you guys. But I just wanted to share with you guys the first background security improvements. It's now available as a test for developers and public beta testers. Thank you for watching. Have a great day, guys, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.